This is terrible. This is not what was supposed to happen at all. That's it. Come right next to it. Good, 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 good. All right, right there. Hang out right there. Hello, everybody. Grace Duel plays, and we're back with more My Summer C4. That's right. An individual on Twitter sent me something and said I should try it. His name is Rocker. And he said, turn the Satsuma. Well, actually, what he really said was, this is how you grill sausages. But what I took it as, as this is how you turn the Satsuma into a giant bomb. So that's what we're going to be doing today. He had a video about it. It's, uh, it, there's no narration, but there are instructions. And we're going to follow the instructions. Because following the instructions is how you keep yourself from getting your genitals chopped off by a spinning chain on the chainsaw. So, it's 6 o'clock in the morning, that's beautiful. There was just an update to my summer car as well. It didn't really do anything, I think. I think it just, like, fixed some parts and some things. Oh, and there's some theme music to my summer car now. And, like, a disclaimer. It says, like, hey, it's my summer car. Things may get screwed up sometimes. Deal with it. And I was like, all right, I'll deal with it. Uh, we have pieces inside of the car. I'm really happy about this. I don't know where our trunk is. But I do have this fender over here, which is kind of nice, because I would like to have as many fenders- Crap. I would like to have as many fenders together as possible as we attempt to do this. So, in our- Son of a bitch. Really? You gonna rain on me? You whore! What is the problem here? Go on! You shouldn't be coming off. You should be going on nice and true. Don't you lie to me. There we go. Just out here in the rain, putting some parts together. You boys know how it is. I don't know where our other muffler is, but quite frankly, I'm freaking sick and tired of hearing this car sounding like a damn rocket ship. So I'm putting on the old muffler. That's right, this is the muffler. It's all rusted up and beat to hell. Who cares though? Again, is that a piece? Yep, hold on. Let's see if I can finish headbutt through here. Is that a piece of sugar inside of our wheel well? I'm not gonna worry about it. Sometimes people are like, Gray, how do you know what wrench to use on the different parts. Let me tell you something. I have fixed and destroyed every single particle in my summer car at this point. I think I've broken damn near everything. The only thing I haven't done, well, there's there's things I haven't done yet. Obviously, turning the Satsuma into a bomb is one of them. The other thing I haven't done, though, is I haven't died from the lightning strike yet. Someone was saying that now you can die from the lightning strike. Crap. There we go. You can die from the lightning strike, even on non-permadeath. I'm not playing on permadeath. I, I tried that masochistic sadness land, and I've had a... What the hell was that? I like the sound of the wildebeest? I could have sworn I heard something out there, boys. Oh, it's the mosquitoes. Of course it is. Well, hold on here. I, got, I could take care of this. We should have... Actually, we've got a ton of shit in the back of our car. I wonder if I have any mosquito repellent inside. Well, no mosquito repellent, but there is a bunch of beer. Might as well cure some of that thirst. This is it, man. One one shot right here. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. <sighs> Boom! Right inside. You don't do that. Yeah, you don't do that without playing this game pro style. I'm going to tell you what. And guess what? I'm working hard for you guys. I bought some new audio equipment that I'm going to be using. So now my voice is gonna be sounding like friggin' honey and butter and honeysuckle deliciousness and, and sex juices and stuff like that. Instead of people being like, Greg, your voice sounds like the nails on the chalkboard and a Peter Griffin mixed with Bill Cosby and Deckard Cade. People will be like, oh my God, Gray, your voice, it's the most magical voice I've ever heard. When I heard your voice at first, I couldn't, I couldn't pass my math test, I couldn't get the job I wanted, I was, I was infertile, everything was going wrong, but then you started talking, and everything was fine, my penis got larger, what the hell is this? What in the hell is this? What kind of crazy sex music? Oh god! Ah, uh, ah, uh, no, no, not up, down, there we go, that sounded weird, anyway, and all that sort of thing and I was able to impregnate various individuals, and it was fantastic. That's what's gonna happen. You boys just wait. I need to make sure as well that, because we need several things to make this happen. Now, the first thing that we're gonna need is beer, which we do have. The other thing that we're gonna need is our gas tank, which I think we also have. Someone was like, great, 
Why don't you put those extra springs on? Oh, you know what? I'm gonna take this over here. Why don't you put those extra springs on that you've been meaning to put on for the last, like, 35 episodes? Well, I'm lazy. I wish I had a better... I wish I had a better reason for you, but I, I don't. Um, that's... It's ba that's basically what it is. I'm very I'm very lazy. Uh, I just haven't been able to do it. This thing still sounds really loud. I feel like the crappy exhaust thing isn't actually doing anything. Now, the second thing that we're gonna have to get... Let me go ahead and start her off over here. Does this thing still have, like, three times power? I don't think it does anymore. I think I have it back on normal. I... I... Possibly. I'm not 100% sure. It's driving very well. So I think it's most likely back on default, which is good. Two. Son of a bitch. All right, so we're back on to our regularly scheduled program. I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. The good news is, is that everything is fixed. All I had to do was just get something to drink. You know how it is. That's how it works over here in Finland. The bad news is, is that instead of grabbing a beer, I ended up grabbing a gallon of kill you. So now I'm freaking schnockered off my ass over here. So anywho, one of the- son of a bitch. One of the next things that we're gonna- really? One of the next things that we're- where the hell did my axe go? No! No- oh, there it is. It's right over here. See, I'm so drunk I can't even see my axe anymore. One of the things that we're gonna need is gonna be a bunch of logs that's going to allow our sausage- Holy Jesus. That's gonna allow our sausage fire to be extra awesome. So you wanna come over here, and I don't know what the- Oh my god, I can't hit the logs because I'm too drunk! I don't know what the appropriate number is, but I would really, really get off the stump. Get off the stump. Get off the stump. Get off the stump. You son of a bitch. Get off the stump. Get, okay. All right. Okay. All right. That's fine. There we go. I don't know what the appropriate number of logs is. I'm going to go with like a dozen log chunklets. I would say that that's good enough. Now, when you're chopping your log over here, you may notice that the log might take like 30 or 40 hits. To actually, de all right, you know what? Screw this. May take like 30 or 40 hits to destroy the log. Oh, you can't get a secondary log to break the first log? No, Deb, you fixed it. Ah, ah, ah. There we go. I just used another log to break the first log, and that seemed to work pretty good. Now the only issue is, is that oh my god, is that if some of the logs are like on top of one another. They don't seem to want to do as they're freaking told. Okay, you see this right here? Let me show you the finished way of doing this. Now, I don't know where my axe just went. <sighs> okay, so anyway, what you do is you pick... Oh, okay, there it was. It was just hiding. You pick up another log, all right, and then you, you beat the first log. There we go. You beat the first log with it, and it breaks in half like so. So getting logs, little bit more annoying than it used to be. I, I think I could, there we go. That one worked out really well. What the hell? That one, all right. That was interesting. There we are. Now we're shooting logs into the stratosphere the way it's supposed to be. Now everything's working just fine. Maybe we're getting less drunk. Okay, that should be enough firewood. All right, we're still a little drunk, but I think we're going to be just fine. Now you may be saying to yourself, great. What is all the wood for? Well, let me tell you something. In order to get that appropriate smoky taste from your sausages, you want to have a nice wood fire. Some people might want to use, you know, accelerant or gasoline or kerosene, but that gives a kind of like a non-authentic taste to it. We want that finish touch. And for that, we need firewood plucked straight from nature itself. Over here, this is going to give our sausage the absolute best aftertaste, before taste, and current taste it could possibly have. I'm not going to lie, I'm also curious what sort of other strange things the creator has shoved into this game during this update. Very often, he hides things from you. The update came out today, although it'll be yesterday for you guys when you see this video. But it came out today, not long ago, uh, when I looked at it, and I, you know, it says things like, oh, you know, it updated the wear on some of the parts, and uh, it's got music on the on the title screen, but I don't believe that's it. I I have my suspicions that there's other oddities afoot in this game, and there often is. Right now, I feel like, and this is trivial, mind you, I feel like I can hear better sounds, if that makes any sense. Like, I can hear the rocks crackling under the, the wheels a little bit better. Now, recognize, 
this is just my suspicion. This just comes from millennia of playing this game here. You know what I mean? I mean, just it feels like a lifetime I've been inside of uh, Finland over here messing around in my summer car. I think some of our drunkenness is finally going away. Obviously, it's Saturday, so it is rally day. We do have the rally sign still up. Sorry if you guys are getting a little seasick from my previous drunkenness. It looks like most of it's wearing off now. Ah, uh, we're still a little wobbly. Now, someone had mentioned on the forums that they felt like the Satsuma lost a lot of its power with the update. Um, I'm reserving judgment right now, but I kind of feel the same way. Although, to be fair, I also have like 4,000 pounds of beer and sausage in the car. So that could be it as well. You know, I never had any issues with the police after that one episode where we went buck wild and ended up tossing the police into each other and beating everyone down with beer bottles and stuff like that. Totally left me alone. Haven't heard a peep from them. I don't know if they're going to come for my ass one day or if I'm going to get a, a bill in the mail or... I mean, what is the light? What is the cost of a life in Finland? I mean, is it like a pack of sausage or... Like a bottle of kill you or something like that. I really don't know. I, I've never, I've never had anyone yet punish me for my misdeeds. I got an achievement for mistakenly drinking that kill you as well. I don't remember what it was because I wasn't paying attention enough. But I definitely got an achievement for it, and that was weird because that achievement was not there before. Because if it was there before, we've drank plenty of kill you. Actually, we we drank so much kill you that we killed ourselves when our bladder exploded. So. There, we, there, I definitely should have had that before. Now that should be, yeah, that's not what I'm looking for. All right, everything still appears to be where I left it. We are no longer drunk. I can tell this from the finish test. See, the finish test is if you look at a beer and you don't sway, you're, you're feeling just fine. Let me go ahead and take my harness off here. We may want to get some gas too. Now I brought with us this diesel can because, well, for a couple reasons. One, I think we should probably fill this thing up. I don't know if it has any gas in it. And I also don't know how explosive diesel fuel is. Yeah, you see that? There was no diesel fuel inside of this canister. So we're definitely going to want to get this filled up. You never know, we may get a better bomb if I use this. Now, if I remember correctly, diesel... Oh, God, if I say the wrong thing, you guys are going to roast me. Diesel burns hotter than normal gas. Is that right? <laughs> but it's less combustible oh god i need to look this crap up before i start saying things let's go inside of here real quick so inside of here yeah it's it's me man it's me uh is there anything new and exciting i can buy in here no there's still sugar uh there is mosquito spray i'm gonna buy one of those real quick is that what the hell is this this is like aloe vera or something it looks like four leaf clover i'm gonna buy a couple of milks to get something to drink without making myself drunk uh let's see over here we have all the sausage that we're ah screw it you know what you can never have enough sausage go ahead and give me all the sausage real quick and then is there new stuff on the shelves over here i feel like there's new stuff on the shelves what the crap is this le hapgulia is that like chicken noodle soup over here? Herne cake toa? It looks like chicken noodle soup. Oh god, what is all this stuff? I don't even know. If it's juice frog, is this like apple juice? Apple sini. Apple sini? Ah, whatever. Oh hey, I found my trunk. Well, that's good. See how this game works? You just gotta play long enough and you'll eventually find all your parts. This is probably important because it has my license plate on it. I'm not sure how annoyed the cops get for not having your license plate in this game. They don't really seem to care about murder. So, to be fair, the whole license plate thing is probably a non-issue. Now, how's the neighbor doing over here? Are you, are you still, like, is your car... Can I touch it, or is any of this interactable yet? No, it doesn't look to be interactable. It doesn't look like anything's really changed. I almost feel like the coloration on some of the doors in the shops and stuff have changed, though. Anything over here? Can you... Nope, can't touch the door. All right, so one of the next steps is you're going to want to grab your gas can. Now, in the instructional video, a gas can was utilized. It wasn't the diesel can. It was the gasoline can. So I want to make sure... What the hell happened to all my wood? Son of a bitch. When I, I saved my game for a couple of reasons. One, because I've died plenty enough to know better. But all my wood's gone. That makes me so angry. Now I don't have any wood to make... Oh, well. So we're not going to be getting the classic wood char grill. 
I don't know what I'm gonna use instead. Maybe I'll try and kill the yellow car guy and put his body in here or something. He can naturally flavor our progress. We might as well do this right next to the fuel pumps as well. Is that full? Oh, lucky us. I guess the gas can is full. Well, isn't that nice? Go ahead and close it here. F key to close it, by the way. Sometimes people want to know how to close the damn thing. It's the F key. It's the same thing that you utilize to open up your uh, tool backs. All right, so pop open the old thingy over here. Finish headbutt one of these tubes out of the way. No big deal. Now we go ahead and head right over here. Oh, that reminds me too. Hold on, let me go ahead and close this up. You want to close this because you want to make sure that you have a platform for all of your sausages. Now, if you're a baller, you can throw your shit. Well, actually, I think that one landed. If you're a baller, you can throw your sausages on the hood. All right, or you can dent the hood with the sausages. All right. Turn on the old choke here. Now we'll start hitting the old rever. You want to make that needle bounce, boys. You want to make that needle bounce big time. We want to see this number go way up. Way up. And we should be seeing flames momentarily. Luckily, thanks to the power of YouTube, what may be three or four or five or 20 minutes for me will just be about 10 seconds for you. Oh, we're starting to see smoke. There we go. Yeah, good, G good. All right, now, what you want to do is you want to grab your gasoline Okay, and you want to go ahead and fuel the fire here. Let's go ahead and uh, drop that right on top of there. Now, I assume you... Oh, <laughs> uh, was everything I hoped it would be. Oh, the radio's still working. That's interesting. Well... Well, boys, I would say it worked. Now, the question is, the question is, will it start back up? I'm going to assume no. Find out, though. We did just blow up the car. Uh, that is a negatory. Now, how about this? Would diesel fuel do the same thing? All right, boys, we're going to give the diesel fuel a test, but I've got an idea. Here's what we're gonna do. Actually, you know what? Hold on, I'm gonna get this set up now. We're gonna park this thing next to yellow car guy, and I'm gonna see if the explosion kills his ass. I hope it does. I'm not a vengeful person, but I will say that he's given me enough trouble to the point where I don't mind seeing him die horribly. Let's go ahead and put a couple of sausage on here though, because you know, you wanna pull double duty. If I, if I could say one thing, it's this. Don't ever neglect or squander a car fire all right actually you know what now is probably a good time for me to put down some gray disclaimers kids don't try and set cars on fire and cook sausages on them it's probably not a good idea you son of a bitch you may be saying to yourself but great you do it what could be so bad about it well i'm a professional jackass and you have to leave this sort of jackassery to the professionals. Hello, sir. Let me just go ahead and park right next to you. There we go. We're going to want to get right up in his grill. So let's go ahead and start this thing bouncing. All right, test number two was a dud. I'm not sure what happened. We didn't get any flames, though. So I couldn't set anything on fire. Hold on here. Let me go ahead and... Uh, let me, I, I'm not even going to open the door. Let me just go ahead and duck on in here. Hit the old hood lock. I did everything the same. I had sausages on there and everything as well. Let's go ahead and pop that off. Put that on there. How about this? No sausages this time. Go ahead and grab the diesel. Put the diesel over here inside. This way it's nice and prepared for us. No, 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 no. Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere, you jackass. Shit. Ah, I'm inside the burning vehicle. This is terrible. This is not what was supposed to happen at all. That's it. Come right next to it. Good, 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 good. All right. Right there. Hang out right there. All right, we got the... D yeah! Whoa! Holy crap! Did you see that fireball? That was awesome! The diesel was way better than the last one. Holy God! Oh! Look at what happened to the car! Okay. That was awesome. That was way better than the gasoline. I don't know if it was because it was diesel or what. What the crap, though? Is it still running? Is the car still running? It is! 
How is this possible? The car is still running. <laughs> All right. So we're going to give this one more try, but we're going to do something a little bit different here this time. This time, we're going to use the gas and the diesel, and we're going to see if that does anything in particular. Let me go ahead and lift this hood up. So remember, what you got to do is you got to pop the hood, take that hose off, you put your hood back down there. If you want to grill up some sausages, that's fine. We're going from grilling, though, to creating the most, the most insane explosion we possibly can. Starter up here. Go ahead and get into position. Now, I'd like to see if I can get right next to him without him moving. So let's, I'm not gonna, I'm like gonna nudge, I'm not even gonna nudge him. Hold on. Just right, right like there. Okay, right there. Right there. All right, let me go ahead and put the parking brake on. Throw the choke on. Let's go ahead and rev the living hell out of this. I'm gonna put both these outside so that we're ready to throw them on the fire. Now, hopefully we get the flames this time because the last time, well, the time before the last time, we didn't get the flames. We want an appropriate amount of fire before we start throwing fuel onto it. Now, he's looking right at it. His window's down. This should be an excellent potential death scene. All right, no good. We didn't get any flames again. So what I'm going to do is instead of driving the Satsuma down here to get the fuel tank, I'm going to drive the shit tanker down here to get the fuel tank. Maybe it's because I'm using the Satsuma for driving instead of just, like, blowing up. I'm not really sure. I'm going to go ahead and put this right over here. Jump on inside of the old beater van. Grab this right up in here. Put it inside. Please, door, don't open up on me. All right, let's give this a shot. All right. I got everything set up. Now, unfortunately, he got close enough to see me. He's like a freaking T-Rex. You know, if, you, if he senses movement. So if you move around too much, he'll end up seeing you. But hopefully we can get this thing on fire. Once it's on fire, it appears to attract this guy like a, like a moth. Like a moth to a flame. Actually, maybe he'll just run into the wall. That would be fantastic as well. All right, now don't die on me. Come on, catch on fire. Catch on fire for gray, baby. I usually have problems keeping things from blowing up, and now this thing won't blow up when I want it to. Come on. Catch on fire. Catch on fire. Yeah. 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 Okay, good. Good. Excellent. Okay. Go grab this. That right there. This. Okay. Ready, boys? All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So, one. All right. Well. I wanted to get both on there. The explosion is getting better each time. The ground is littered with parts of the car. Oh, there's the gas tank. Isn't that nice? Really? Really? Ow! So anyway, it absolutely works. What else can we do with our Setsuma bomb? I don't know. I have to think about that. We do have an explosive device at our disposal now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode of My Summer Card. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.